what is up you guys so today I have for you another new video and this is gonna be a video on how to make a pathway that changes color yeah let's get started okay so we want to change the color of this pathway as the golf cart moves to the right so wherever it leaves it makes a pathway that changes color so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna duplicate this layer and then what we're going to do is we're going to click on that rotor brush tool and we're going to just mask out that pathway that we want to change color. So we're going to go frame by frame and we're going to just adjust the brush so that it just picks up the pathway. So what you can do is you can also hold on to alt um, so that it will change to this red color and it will erase the parts instead of adding on parts so the green adds on stuff and the red removes it if you picked up too much things and also you can use the command tool to make your brush larger or smaller so I'm just going frame by frame and clicking command and the right arrow key and go frame by frame and as the golf cart is moving I'm just adjusting the pathway so that it picks up more until the end of the golf the golf what is that called the golf car golf car i don't know wait why can't i remember this okay yeah so yeah as you can see i i picked up everything is it a golf cart oh my god this is okay yeah i think it's a golf cart <laughs> Okay, so as you can see, I went frame by frame, and I'm just going to stop here. I finished using the rotor brush tool to pick up the path that I want to change color. So if we play back the clip, nothing happens. But if we turn off the bottom layer, then you can see the pathway that we um, masked out. Now what we want to do is click on that top layer, and then search up hue, saturation, and add that to the top layer. Now what we can do is we can... Um, go to the end of where we stop the roto brush tool. Um, you could just approximate. I'm just approximating. Um, so I'm just gonna leave that arrow there. And you, as you can see, if you move this tool, you can see the color change a little bit. So we're gonna keep that color somewhere in the middle, wherever we want it to start. You can adjust the saturation to make the colors look more vibrant. So I'm just gonna put this to 67. Press the keyframe button, and then now we're going to go back to the beginning of the clip and then uh, turn the direction so it makes a full circle. So now if you play back your clip, you can see that the color is changing um, of the pathway that we carved out. So let's just go to the end of where we use the rotor brush tool, and then we're going to command shift D to split the clip and then just delete the rest of the clip. So if we play it back, we can see this path is being um, drawn out, and it's changing color. And yeah, that's the, that's the whole tutorial. Pretty easy. Um, yeah, you can make the saturation a little bit brighter if you want. I think that could look a little bit better. And I'm also just going to add some coloring so you can see what it looks like with some color grading. So yeah, that's the full tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Uh, subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.